Over 2,000 years ago, a Greek astronomer mapped the stars, unveiling secrets of the universe. His name was Hipparchus. Unlike those before him, he didn't just observe, he measured. He compiled the first known star catalog, classifying over 850 stars by their brightness, a system astronomers still use today. But something was wrong. The stars weren't exactly where they should be. Comparing his observations with older Babylonian records, he made a groundbreaking discovery. The Earth's axis was shifting. He had discovered the precession of the equinoxes, a phenomenon that takes thousands of years to complete. Using trigonometry, he estimated the distance to the moon with surprising accuracy, paving the way for future celestial measurements. He also refined the length of the year to 365.242 days, influencing the calendars we use today. To make his calculations easier, he laid the groundwork for trigonometry, introducing early sign functions that would later shape mathematics. His methods went beyond astronomy. He used his star catalog to improve navigation, allowing sailors to use the stars to find their way across vast seas. Though much of his original work was lost, his findings shaped Ptolemy's model of the universe and influenced scientists for centuries. Hipparchus, the father of astronomy and trigonometry, who mapped the heavens and measured the cosmos, proving that science is built upon careful observation and precise mathematics.